surface calibration procedure provides technicians an option to reset weighing range parameters back to near factory default conditions. Error codes that may have been displayed during a standard calibration will also be cleared. The procedure shown is applicable to COMBIX indicators, but it is also possible to perform the same procedure on Midrix products. There are substantial differences between the service calibration and standard calibration. Standard calibration adjusts weighing range only without clearing linearity or dead load. Service calibration will overwrite A to D parameters while clearing linearization and dead load settings. Also, the service calibration will eliminate INF71 error messages. And finally, the service calibration allows the weighing range to be calibrated even if the scale display is unstable. These conditions can occur when the indicator is moved from a high capacity tank or floor scale to a load cell bench scale. The following screen will show an example of an unstable scale that was recalibrated using the service calibration function. To begin the procedure, turn the scale off and then back on using the on off key. Once you press it a second time, press tear during the digit check, the scale will advance to the menu mode. Press function key until setup is shown, press tear to WP1, and function key several times until you see the prompt U code. At the prompt U code, press tear and key in the service code 202122. Once this code is entered, it is important to hold the tear key, not just touch it. That will enable the calibration in the service mode. Press the zero key twice until setup is displayed. Hold the tear key again to change back to the live weighing mode. To start the service calibration, press ISO test. You'll be prompted at Cal E user to press the ISO test again. It'll display a specified calibration weight. You must use exactly this value. And then finally press ISO test a third time to calibrate the scale, clear all linearization and dead load parameters. The scale is now calibrated and is ready for use or re-entry of new linearization and dead load parameters. It's important to keep in mind that when the scale is turned off, the service calibration will be erased and the ISO test key will resume its normal function as a standard calibration key. This concludes this demonstration of the service calibration procedure. Thank you.